Hello guys, today we learn how to import data from CSV file into SQL Server using SSIS SQL Server Integration Services. For this we have required SQL Server Data Tools for Visual Studio 15 or SQL Data Tools for our Visual Studio 2019 SQL Server Instance and one more file csv file with data for import first you will see what is csv file let us see you go to test folder and here there is one csv file emp sample.csv now right click and open it so here you will see there is three column like employee id employee name employee photo and vertical var is separation and double code for identifier now close this one now go to visual studio 2015 and go to file new project <laughs> then you will see business intelligence integration services select this one and put here import data from csv file csv file to sql server using sss ssis now click on ok button when project will be created you can see here as solution explorer and then after that you will see ssis tool in ssis toolbox first you need to click on data flow so you see here data flow design has been created data flow docs has been created now in bottom of you can see connection manager here you can click right click and add new connection otherwise here my vision is import data from csv file to sql server so next step is go to ssis tools and see the flat files where flat files after that you put data flow tasks you need to click on data flow tasks double click then after that double click we will go here and check the data source like our data source is flat file source then you can click on flat file source your flat file source has been created now click on double this flat file source and after that you need to define a connection stream so click on new then you can change it also connection manager name and here select a file in browse our file is csv file so put csv files and you will see imply sample csv file is there in test folder and click on open so our text qualifier i have seen that is double code and header row del delimiter is vertical bar so need to choose vertical bar then after that you check column here imply id imply name imply photo advance you can also change data type if you required and also you can click on preview so your data will be displayed here now go to journals and click on ok button and then again click on ok so flat file data source file has been 
configure with connection exchange now i have to transfer flat file csv file to sql so we need to oled big data connection other destinations see here now i have to choose oled click on double oled big connection and you see here OLE, ole db destination has been created now map to flat file to oled db connections after that you need to click double on this icon and put the connection manager so click on new already there so first you need to delete it and now again put here new then you have to put the server name what is your server name is computer name here you can connect and take the computer name or server name and put the server name here and authentication you will take sql server then here username and password need to put here then after that you can drag and increase the size and you can click here and see the database name in this database and click on ok and then ok after that name of the table are we where do you want to import the data so if already you define then you can put here from this otherwise you need to create click here new and put here like test employee table name where data will be imported copy here and click on ok button so you can see here our table name will be test employee then after that you need to click also check whether it mapping there or not so see here mapping it is already there then click on ok so our mapping will be done from source to destination files and i need to run this application now start so you can see here our package will successfully run and photos will be imported from csv file to sql server for checking this let us open test database and select the table name select star from table name what i put there test imply and click on execute so you can see here four data will be imported from this csv file to sql server thanks for watching my youtube videos if you want to more videos please subscribe my youtube channel